U.S. stocks continuing to trade lower this Monday afternoon right here on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. This as the post-Brexit sell-off continues right here amongst investors at the New York Stock Exchange as well as worldwide. Meanwhile, on the domestic data front, there is some news. The market flash services PMI for the month of June coming in unchanged from the previous month at a rate of 51.3. Now, switching focus to see how the Forex markets are doing. The U.S. dollar still remaining bullish against its counterparts. We take a look first at the Euro-U.S. dollar pair, which is right now 0.83% higher at 110.25. Meanwhile, the British pound-U.S. dollar pair that has hit its first target at $1.32. The relative strength index is bearish and calling for further downside. Short positions below 134.70 are favored with down targets at 130 and 127 in extension. And lastly, the U.S. dollar Japanese yen pair just about a half a percent lower at a read of 101.70 yen. This while over in precious metals, we are continuing to see positive trade. Gold is 0.09 percent higher at a read of 1. What, 13 23.65 a troy ounce this while silver that's in focus as the pair remains above its support at 17.43 the relative strength index lacking downward momentum so long positions above 17.43 are favored for silver with targets at 18.32 and 18.45 in extension and don't forget to follow trading central on twitter at trading central for all of your forex market updates and for trading central web tv from the floor of the new york stock exchange i'm james swinney